if you could smell. Ugh. You may be wondering, so what are these? And my wild guess is some sort of sea plant that's being dried up. <coughs> I've never been a big, big, big friend of fish myself, so <coughs> I'll be just going on. Hello everyone, it's been a long while since the last video, sorry about that, but how has everyone been doing? And I hope you enjoyed the last video I made, it was kind of an off topic, or not an off topic, but it's, it felt like something I had had coming for a long while. Holy smokes, what is this? Something's telling me I'm not gonna be the first one going down there. I hope this won't turn my own 120 hours movie. Yeah. Uh. All right, come, come here. Woo. Woo. <laughs> Well, ain't this, ain't this snappy. This is pretty cool. Woohoo! On a second thought, it was a cool first impression. But I think I'm gonna just keep going. I don't know. I don't know what that... I don't know what that crap was I stepped, stepped on, but... <coughs> okay, so why all this radio silence? Why well, I haven't made a new actual traveling vlog? Well, instead I could tell you what I have been doing and that's been checking off for about four days through it. I've kind of had my inspiration gone for the whole time. I managed, I somehow managed to make the a uh, compilation video of the all of all the best drone shots and it turned out very nice but other than that it's been slow going i've been driving may maybe 100 kilometers per day and now i finally made it all the way to do the lofoten and boy this is actually this is actually a pretty nice place if you don't take in count the high prices and narrow small roads but i've had only chance twice to catch some new footage because for the rest of the time there has been coming down snow water hail all the all the forms of white shit that could come down from the sky and it's been slow going because of that the weather has been quite terrible even for driving from time to time also it has been kind of windy so when there hasn't come anything down from the sky it's been pretty much blowing my hair off my head I think the weather itself, also the slow going and the fact that I haven't had much chances to catch any new scenery on, the, on top of that, but also because my mood has been kind of down lately. Don't ask me why, I don't know myself. And pretty much all I've good think of doing has been <laughs> jacking off, <laughs> playing games, uh, watching series. Uh, on a side note, I actually watched all the <laughs> seasons of Breaking Bad. Uh, now, if we try to find a silver lining of the slow going and a crappy weather, could be the fact that I was thinking about whether I should drive all the way back. It's about 300 kilometers the same way I came and then maybe an extra 200 kilometers until I would make it uh, to the Sweden. But I was thinking about maybe going back the all the way or maybe I should be taking a ferry from here until I, I did some calculations and came to a conclusion that I'm not rich enough to actually take a ferry. It would cost for my car plus myself about 200 euros. I was thinking about, yeah, nope. So yeah, I'll be saving about 100 euros when I'll be driving all the way back myself. At least the view is nice. I don't know if you can hear them, but I hate seagulls. Maybe, maybe my hate towards seagulls stems from last year. It was in, it was one in Denmark and the Pokemon Go game had actually came out just recently. 
or it hasn't come out yet, but uh, you were able to download it uh, by using VPNs and whatnot. So. Uh, me and my friend, while in Denmark, in a scouts camp, we decided to give it a go and we would like run around the <laughs> nearby areas for three or four hours at a time. It just happened that there was this cool area that had about... I think it had three Pokestops, the places where you get items and shots. And it was a good place to go around and around and find new Pokemon and all that. So overall a good place, considering it was just the beginning of Pokemon Go. And uh, there was this one seagull that was such a bitch! It was obviously defending its territory and possible offspring. We would just go walking there and whenever we would hear this... <coughs> sound when anywhere we would we would con we would constantly pick up stones like oh you want you want another one of this huh you want another one and we whenever it flo flew close enough we would just throw rocks at it because it constantly tried to shat on us plus it would keep making that annoying sound and just flow just above us and <laughs> We got a little, we got a little ticked off at this, at uh, this per particularly annoying seagull. It, it actually happened that I had this green laser pointer with me. I, ju I happened to have it one evening with us, and I decided to fuck off. I just, I just blindly pointed at the direction of the seagull. When all of a sudden it would just boom, <laughs> take like the fastest fly away you've ever seen, and we would be laughing like, oh well. That apparently did the trick, until like five or ten minutes later, the same seagull came back and the same sang went on. <laughs> so from that point on, we'll just take out the laser pointer and point it out whenever it came too, too close, or whenever we would see, oh, there she comes again. <laughs> it was like the best air defense mechanism possible, but. Other than that, thank everybody again yet so much for watching. I really appreciate it if you if you came back here after all these days. I know it's kind of a pain way, wanting to see what's next and waiting for a new video. But I, I kind of wanted to dodge the burnout. I didn't want to bring a video that would have nothing in it to offer. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna start trying to do some other, to other kind of topic videos from here on out if ever if this kind of situation ever happens to come again that I, I simply can't catch enough video or footage or have anything have anything in interest to tell you but I'm gonna try and better it from here still thank you again everybody so much for being here and watching and as for now I hope to see all of you in the next video see you later ciao